Yo, yo, YouTube. What's cracker like a jack of smacking? It's Waffle Man with a video, and welcome to episode 17 or 16 of the Thursday Talk Show. I keep losing count, but you know, we have a lot of episodes so far. So, what's the topic for the day? It's my team. Why is it my team? Because I just started playing my team about a week ago, and I'm not going to spoil anything for my future videos because. I'm not going to be here next week because I'm going to Florida and all those videos are already made. But let's just say right now I'm in the second seed, about to move on to the first seed. So yeah, I already got to the first seed already. I'm a beast, as you can tell. You know, I'm always a beast at everything in 2K. But why am I talking about my team? Because my team is cheese. My team is a cheese mode. I mean, th there's just some things in the mode that doesn't even make any sense. Maybe it's because I'm a noob at my team, even though I'm still a beast player. But maybe I don't know enough about my team, but my team is really cheese. First of all, when I'm playing and I'm versing someone in World to Playoffs, and I face all these people, first of all, why does everyone seem to have like an OD stacked team? Their team is completely stacked. Now, I'm not going to say my team isn't stacked, you know, Damian Lillard, Paul George, Scotty Pippen You know my team's not bad, but when, when I face a team with freaking uh, what, is, what is it? They got Michael Jordan, LeBron James, Kevin Durant, Dwight Howard, Will Chamberlain I'm like what is going on here? How, like how does and first of all you don't understand how many people I face have Michael Jordan Almost every single person I face has Michael Jordan How is that even possible? I mean, are these people just opening up Bulls packs, like 90 Bulls pack a day? Like, what is this? And, and I don't even know what you get in the first seed. But if you get Michael Jordan, then I guess the the good explanation would be that these guys already completed World to Playoffs and are just playing it again for some reason. But I don't know, man. It's just it's out of control. And then another thing is that since the CPU in this game, first of all, I don't know why for me, but... This game is just cheesing me all over the place. All over the place, this game is just cheesing me. Like, I inbound the ball, and my players inbound the ball to no one. They threw the ball straight out of bounds. One time, this happened like five times in the game. I almost, yo, listen, I almost cried during the game, man. This is how real it is. I'm, I'm not on Cash Nasty's level. I'm not on watching McCollin's level of raging when playing my team. But listen, man, this game makes me super angry. And it just, it just makes me, it's just unbelievable the amount of cheese. And then the people of Michael Jordan, the people that have those sack teams, some of those people are cheesing. Matter of fact, I'd say 70 or 60%, 60% to 80% of those people are cheesing with those players. First of all, there's some type of cheese in the game where you post up and you just press R2 and you turbo to the paint and it's a dunk every time. Literally, I could not stop these people with Michael Jordan dunking on me every time and then whenever I would score or take the lead they would just start cheesing with Jordan they'd start cheesing with their whole team and another thing about my team which I don't know maybe it's the game's mechanics but there's just way too many people left wide open I mean just way too many people left wide open I don't even know it's, if it's something on my team or something but my team just allows so many people to be open and then when I go on offense I feel like I can't even I can't even freaking score but I still end up winning all my games you know I'm, I'm in the freaking first seed for crying out loud but I just freaking I'm not able to score and here's something else that, that was cheese the injuries in this game now contracts you know if you don't have enough contracts then you could always buy contracts with my team points you know right there but with injuries if you don't have injury cards then you're screwed so this is what happened to me today and first of all I've never seen any of my opponents players get injured before actually no there was this one time where yeah my I think my players opponent actually no that was a my career game never mind so you see my opponent has never experienced injured players and me I have an injured player every like what four to five games it's ridiculous. I mean, that doesn't sound like a lot, but my injuries happened frequently. I mean, this guy, they made a little tourist ACL. From what? From getting a rebound? C 
Come on, man. How do you turn the ACL from getting a rebound? And here's the cheesiest injury that just happened to me today. Kevin Durant takes a jump shot. And he's out for 16 games, man. What, what, what happened to him? I don't even know what the injury was. And I only had a five-game injury card and a one-game injury card. So I had like I took off like six games. So basically, I had to wait. I had to play ten games before I could get my Sapphire Kevin Durant back. Are you kidding me? Sapphire Kevin Durant isn't his durability like almost a like 95 or something? Kevin Durant never gets injured. And he gets injured and he's out for 16 games? What? At that point, I was like, this is ridiculous. I mean, I played like two games and I won them without Kevin Durant. Because I've been playing without Kevin Durant and Michael Jordan before. So, you know, I was good. And then I was like, you know what? This is nonsense. I'm in the second seed. People are cheesing. Kevin Durant's been killing it for me. And I need Kevin Durant. So I tried to open up some packs and, you know, you don't get any injury cards. So all I did... So I went to domination mode, and I just, I just uh, went in the game and kept quitting. I had to do it, man. Listen, this game was cheesing me. I had to cheese this game right back. 16 games doesn't even make any sense. That's a long time, man. 16 games? This is my team. This ain't, this ain't like my GM. I don't understand like five games or seven games, but 16 games? That's like 16 hours without this guy, man. It's unbelievable. So yeah, my team, man, I don't know. This is just some cheese elements. And I don't know. Sometimes when I open up packs, I know you're not supposed to get good players every time. But god damn. Can you at least give me a player? Like maybe once in a while? You know, you guys know my favorite player is Carmelo Anthony. And so when I I just I just build up my my team points and I just buy a Knicks pack. And out of all the Knicks packs I opened, I have not received Carmelo Anthony. Matter of fact, the only player good that I've kept from the Knicks that I've received was Amari Stoudemire. And the funny thing is, every time I open a pack, sometimes I get the same player. That's completely nonsense. I'm trying to get Chris Mullen, Tim Hardaway, or Mitch Rich as well. And I open up the Warriors pack like, like almost every day now. After I get some, you know, my team points. And you know what I get? I get that same center I always get. Like, why is that? How do you get the same player multiple times and not even any other player? I got, I, I've got a Metal World Peace like three times. Andre Bayani twice. I've gotten Bino Ujo like three times. I've gotten Pablo Pudge only like twice. I've only gotten Amari Stoudemire once. But like, where are the other players? Where's J.R. Smith? Where's Tyson Chandler? Wayman Felton, maybe? I mean, I don't get, I don't get anything. I'm trying to get Carmelo Anthony. It's ridiculous, man. Like, is he impossible to get? I mean, come on, man. I expect to get some different players, even in the Warriors pack. Like, you can't give me one of the big three. I can't, like, I don't know. I just feel like the packs sometimes are just, it's just too cheese, man. I mean, I can't even, I'm just getting bronze players every time. And especially in the gold packs. The gold packs are freaking rip-offs sometimes, man. I've gotten the same player five times from the gold packs. And that thing costs like 45,000 my team points. So my team, man, my team is just cheesing me. I see how why people get angry at my team. Especially since I think my team's been playing on All-Star right now. It's not even on Hall of Fame, so... Yeah, it's just so much three-point cheese. Like, the three-point cheesing is off the charts. The charge cheesing is off the charts. People take charges way too much. And also, the block dunks and the freaking steals are ridiculous. People are just poking the ball out loose. They're just spamming square, and the game is giving them the benefit of the doubt, man. This game should not reward people that don't know how to play the game, man. Don't let me... And I'm not... Oh, my goodness. This is so much cheese. I, I could just... If only I had the videos, man. I mean, I have the videos, but they're not out yet. It's just so cheese, man. Especially in the paint. You don't understand how many shots my point guard, Allen Iverson, has missed. My freaking players have missed, man. This is ridiculous. I mean, it's, it's unbelievable. But anyways, YouTube, I'm out. Peace.